Dear students, today I will teach you a poem which the name is The Road Not Taken. Priya Chhatro, aaj mein aapko ek kavita sikhaunga jiska naam hai The Road Not Taken. So let's begin. The Road Not Taken Part 2 Thinking About the Poem Thinking about the poem Kavita ke baare mein socha kar I Question 1 Where does the traveler find himself? What problem does he face? Question 1 Yatri khud ko kaha paata hai? Usse kya samasya aati hai? Answer The traveler finds himself in the yellow woods at a point where the road forks into two. Answer Yatri khud ko peeli jungle mein ek bindu par paata hai jahan sadak do mein milti hai. The problem that he faces is that he cannot decide which road to take to continue his journey since it is not possible for him to travel both roads at the same time. वह जो समस्या है वह यह है कि वह अपनी यात्रा जारी रखने के लिए यह तय नहीं कर सकती है कि एक ही समय में दोनों सड़कों की यात्रा करना उसके लिए संभव नहीं है क्वेश्चन टू डिस्कस व्हाट दीज फ्रेजेस मीन टू यू क्वेश्चन टू चर्चा करें कि ये वाक्यांश आपके लिए क्या मायने रखते हैं आई ए येलो वुड I ate peely lakadi. E. It was grassy and wanted wear. E. Yeh ghaas wala tha aur ise pehenna chahiye tha. E. The passing there. E. Udhar se gujrna. If leaves no step had trodden black. If koi bhi kadam nahi pada hai. V. How way leads on to way. V. Kis tarah se marg prashast hota hai. Answer. 1. Yellow wood symbolizes the autumn season. Autumn corresponds with old age. The poet could be symbolically talking about the later stages of life. Answer. 1. Peely wood Sharad Ritu ke mausam ka pratik hai. Sharad Ritu burape ke saath mail khati hai. Kavi pratikatmak roop se jeevan ke baad ke charano ke baare mein baat kar sakta hai. Two, it conveys that the road was full of grass and nobody has used that road. It was a smooth road which had not worn out. Two, यह बताता है कि सड़क घास से भरी थी और कोई भी उस सड़क का उपयोग नहीं करता था. यह एक चिकनी सड़क थी जो खराब नहीं हुई थी. Three, the use of the path by passers by. Three, राहगीरों द्वारा पथ का उपयोग. 4. The leaves had not changed their color and turned black because of less people stepping on them. It could represent a path one may have never, seldom taken in life for the fear of uncertainty. 4. Kam logo ne un par kadam rakhne ke karan patto ne apna rang nahi badla aur kale ho gaye. Yeh ek aise marg ka pratinidhitva kar sakta hai jo anishchitta ke dar se jeevan mein kabhi bhi nahi liya ja sakta hai. Five, this phrase means how certain decisions one makes in life could pave the way for many other decisions. Panch, is vakyansh ka arth hai ki jeevan mein kuch nirnaya lene wale kai anya nirnyo ka marg prashast kar sakte hai. Question three, is there any difference between the two roads as the poet describes them? Question 3 क्या दोनों सड़कों में कोई अंतर है जैसा कि कवि उन्हें बताता है? 1. In stanzas 2 and 3. 1. Shlok 2 और 3 में. 2. In the last two lines of the poem. 2. Kavita ki antim 2 panktiyo में. Answer. 1. In stanza 2 the poet explains that the only difference between the two roads was that the road he took had the right to be chosen, the better claim, because it was covered with grass and looked as if it had not been used too much. Answer. 
एक श्लोक दो में कवि बताता है कि दोनों सड़कों के बीच एकमात्र अंतर यह था कि उसने जिस सड़क को चुना था उसे चुनने का अधिकार था बेहतर दावा क्योंकि यह घास से ढका हुआ था और ऐसा लग रहा था जैसे इसे बहुत ज्यादा इस्तेमाल नहीं किया गया हो Besides this difference both roads had been equally worn down by passers by travelling on them in stanza 3 the poet says that both the roads were equally covered with leaves and that no person had stepped on is antar ke alawa dono sadke rahgiron dwara saman roop se kharab kar di gayi thi shlok 3 mein kavi kehta hai ki dono sadke pattiyon se saman roop se dhaki hui thi aur kisi bhi vyakti ne un par kadam nahi rakha tha Two in the last two lines of the poem, the poet says that there is a difference between the two roads because he took the road that was less travelled by other people, and that made all the difference to his journey. दो कविता के अंतिम दो पंक्तियों में कवि कहता है कि दोनों सड़कों में अंतर है क्योंकि उसने उस सड़क को लिया जो अन्य लोगों द्वारा कम यात्रा की गई थी और जिसने उसकी यात्रा के लिए सभी अंतर बनाए. question 4 what do you think the last two lines of the poem mean looking back does the poet regret his choice or accept it question 4 aapko kya lagta hai ki kavita ki antim do panktiyan kya hai piche dekhte hue kavi ko apni pasand par pachtava hai ya ise swikar karna hai answer The last two lines of the poem mean the acceptance of reality. The poet made a choice and accepted the challenging path. Answer: Kavita ki antim do panktiyon ka arth vastavikta ko swikar karna hai. Kavi ne chunav kiya aur chunauti purn rasta swikar kiya. He took an unexplored path in his life. He wanted to do something different in his life, so he chooses the less travelled road. No, he does not regret his choice. उन्होंने अपने जीवन में एक अस्पष्ट रास्ता अपनाया वह अपने जीवन में कुछ अलग करना चाहता था इसलिए वह कम यात्रा करने वाली सड़क चुनता है नहीं उसे अपनी पसंद पर पछतावा नहीं है दो क्वेश्चन वन हैव यू एवर हैव टू मेक अ डिफिकल्ट चॉइस और डू यू थिंक यू विल हैव डिफिकल्ट चॉइसेस टू मेक हाउ विल यू मेक द चॉइस फॉर व्हाट रीजंस क्वेश्चन वन क्या आपको कभी कोई मुश्किल चुनाव करना पड़ा है या क्या आपको लगता है कि आपके पास बनाने के लिए मुश्किल विकल्प होंगे आप चुनाव कैसे करेंगे किन कारणों से Answer 1 No till now I have never been in a situation in which I had to make a difficult choice perhaps I am still too young to make an independent choice yes I think later or sooner I will have difficult choices to make Answer 1 Nahi ab tak main kabhi bhi aisi sthiti mein nahi raha jisme mujhe ek mushkil chunav karna pada shayad main abhi bhi ek swatantra vikalp banane ke liye bahut chhota hu Ha mujhe lagta hai ki baad mein ya jald hi mere paas banane ke liye mushkil vikalp honge After completing my general education I will have to make choice of profession whether I should become an engineer or doctor or something else Apni samanya shiksha puri karne ke baad mujhe peshe ka chunav karna hoga chahe main engineer banu ya doctor ya kuch aur I will have hundreds of option before me Mere samne mere paas sekron vikalp honge Then it will be difficult to make a choice in between them. I will make choice according to my capabilities and strong points at that time. फिर उनके बीच चुनाव करना मुश्किल होगा मैं उस समय अपनी क्षमताओं और मजबूत बिंदुओं के अनुसार चुनाव करूंगा
I will choose a path that gives me satisfaction and mental peace. I will not join the rat race for money. मैं एक ऐसा रास्ता चुनूंगा जो मुझे संतुष्टि और मानसिक शांति दे मैं पैसे के लिए चूहा दौड़ में शामिल नहीं होऊंगा लाइक द पोएट इन पोएम आई विल चूज अ चैलेंजिंग एंड अनएक्सप्लोर्ड पाथ इन माय लाइफ कविता में कवि की तरह मैं अपने जीवन में एक चुनौतीपूर्ण और स्पष्टीकृत रास्ता चुनूंगा Question 2 After you have made a choice do you always think about what might have been or do you accept the reality Question 2 Jab aap ek vikalp bana lete hain to aap hamesha is bare mein sochte hain ki kya ho sakta hai ya kya aap vastavikta ko swikar karte hain Answer taking a decision sometime make a mass of future having made a choice I accept the reality आंसर एक निर्णय लेना कभी कभी हमारे भविष्य को बना देता है एक विकल्प बनाने के बाद मैं वास्तविकता को स्वीकार करता हूँ रिकन्सिडरिंग ए डिसीजन और कॉन्टम्पलेटिंग ओवर इट इज नॉट अ पॉजिटिव अप्रोच टूवर्ड्स लाइफ किसी निर्णय पर विचार करना या उस पर विचार करना जीवन के प्रति सकारात्मक दृष्टिकोण नहीं है Such thoughts never allow us to be happy with what we have gained from our decision. इस तरह के विचार हमें कभी भी खुश नहीं होने देते हैं जो हमने अपने निर्णय से प्राप्त किया है Therefore, I believe in sticking to my decisions. इसलिए मैं अपने निर्णयों पर अडिग हूँ I hope you're learning well. Have you nice day.